Not sure how we but well I can't even talk. Not sure how, but we made it to Florence and we are celebrating as we speak. <laughs> We're right. celebrating the only way we know how. And I would show you guys the Airbnb, it's really cute. However, we've been here for five minutes and have already demolished, demolished it with we our really stuff. Have. Like I'll link everywhere we're staying, you know, in the descriptions, but it's really cute. Let me show you guys. Look at this. Me, please, I need a class. <laughs> this is the balcony, and that's the view right there. That is the Duomo. Are you kidding? Such pretty view. But yeah, we did not have a smooth travel day to say the least. I mean, nothing went like terribly wrong. It just started on the wrong foot when our bus from Lake Como was 30 minutes late. Y'all, Lake Como, beautiful, gorgeous. I feel like it would be an amazing like honeymoon spot once I'm rich. But for like four college girls, I don't know if I would recommend doing it. It was just like so hard to get around there, not complaining. It's just like that stuff you don't know until you go. But it was beautiful. I just didn't vlog it. I found a really cute Airbnb there. I'll link that down below. But yeah, we are here in Florence from Lake Como after like Literally Welcome seven trains. Florence. Oh my god, thank you so much. I was just telling them about Como. Beautiful, but a pain. A little pain in the butt. But you know, all good things. We're in Florence now. I'm so excited. We're having wine. We're gonna get pizza, gelato, everything. This is our little loft. The kitchen and bathrooms are like really updated and modern. You look like you need some more. <laughs> you just poured it. Well, you just look like it. Thank you. Look how nice and updated this kitchen is. Okay, good morning from Zara. We're shook. Annalise keeps looking for her outfits for work, but she does not have a job yet. So if but anyone guys, wants, if imagine, anyone wants to, imagine, yeah, they want to hire me. Let me know because I'll be the best dressed one there at work. Like, oh. imagine that. Imagine. Just get it for an interview. Honestly. Okay, I think I need to go upstairs. Okay, y'all. Can you speak some Italian to them? Si, come stai? Ciao. We are coming guys, to you live from the most the insane day, shopping I've ever you know, I hate shopping, you guys, and I've had the most fun shopping day ever. I completely ever. agree. I don't like it at all, and this just I'm makes it so like much. puts you in a different world. It's the best. We gotta do, it. We gotta do a Zara haul. Well, now it's in a new bag and because it ripped. <laughs> yeah, show them. She never had. Oh my gosh, guys! I never have earrings. And let them show this hat. We just show the hat real quick. Yeah. Say goodbye. So cute. They have a lot of really good leather shops, and my dad like loves good leather, so I got him a really cool journal. It's like chef's kiss, but yeah. If we don't get gelato though, I'm gonna die. No, I need gelato, water. That's about it for me. That's it right now. All right, night time. Do you have anything to say? Um, night time. Can you like? <laughs> we just. <laughs> Take me on. We change. We change. We're new outfits. Wearing our new purses that we got oh, at the leather the shop today. Do you have No. Okay. Um, I, have mine. I have mine. Okay, let's get here. This Look at set. them. But we have had a very successful shopping day. That's like all we've really done today. I'll give a haul, except I have to do exchange some things. The vibes are here though in Florence. This might be like one of my absolute favorite cities now. Like, I get why people study abroad. I probably said that. I want you a good day I'm having. <laughs> Tell the vlog. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Guys, she ordered all of our pizzas. So, Scott. Today, people were yelling at me because I don't take charge. So, you know what? <laughs> I don't know. I'll 
It's like yeah. Yeah. I took freaking charge. I went in there. I ordered them all. Yeah, I got everyone's <laughs> orders. I was communicating back and forth. She went in that busy place. In and out. And, I was and in skipped out. the line and did I, it for I us. I my way. There's one over here. I feel kind of. I feel. <laughs> we found this little bench and we're drinking wine right here. We just had pizza at sunset on the bridge. It was so beautiful. And now Tabby's giving us wine taste testing. And this is our beautiful view. I know you guys have seen this a lot. We're just never over it. Yes, give a review, please. So right here we have the Bella Grill. Yeah. Yeah. On the nose, I'm smelling light notes of like floral. Well, you served the entire group, and they're all happy. So. Friends. Good morning, y'all. Good morning, y'all. Okay, literally out. Out. You're a child. Friggin' crap together. Good morning, y'all. We made it to Rome, and look who's here. It's a special guest. Did y'all think we left her out? Did y'all know she was coming? We're in Rome. This is our Airbnb. It's super cute. We're getting ready right now. We honestly, um, not sure what we're doing today. And after tonight, we don't have like anything of this trip booked. So this is when it's about to get interesting. By that, we mean we have nowhere to stay. Yeah. Basically, we booked this trip. We booked our flight. And no transportation. And we booked like the first week or so. Which I would even recommend not doing. Like, you might find a city and be like, oh, I want to stay longer here. I don't know. But we have six, so we kind of need to plan some stuff. Leslie, you good? Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> oh, we made it to Rome. Um, beautiful Airbnb. We came from Florence, so so far this trip we've done. No, Switzerland, Lake Como, which I barely vlogged about that. It was just, we were there for, like, barely any time. Florence, and now Rome. And it's our first day here. We got in here last night. It's so cute. And I get ready. We want to do like historical stuff, like obviously, like tours and whatnot. But there's also a five story Zara, so that's on the list. Okay, Macy, quick, quick interview. We can't because Annalise isn't going to stop playing music. But the best song ever just came on. Just for a second. This is why she needs a good kiss. Do your freaking interview. Okay, we have a quick interview coming up. <clears throat> I guess it will be nice. Good morning. I'm here with Macy Thompson, YouTube sensation, recent TCU graduate, on her way to Dallas to be a bad queen. Um, I didn't really know the exact title of your job. <laughs> it's okay. You've been in Europe for mm, a little bit now. Um, who is annoying you the most so far? <laughs> Right to it. Um, that's a hard question. It depends. That's a hard question. Everyone is really annoying. <laughs> okay, that was really bad. Okay, we're gonna finish getting ready. We'll do more interviews later. We're gonna roam around Rome. Rome, if you want to. Okay, I told y'all that like each of us were in charge of booking a different Airbnb for each spot. This one's the Rome one. It's called the Lemon Tree Airbnb, and we have like this entire backyard. It's so cute. You're so prairie girl. Hmm? You're so prairie girl. You guys, I am so sad. So basically that footage you just saw of us getting ready in Rome, that is the only footage I have from the entire three days in Rome because basically I switched some setting on my camera. I don't know what I did, but all of it is messed up and each clip that I tried to film is only two seconds long. It must have been on like a timer for two seconds or something. I don't know. Anyways, I wanted to share this tour company because I obviously vlogged it and I didn't get to include it. This is not sponsored or anything, but we use this website called limoandrome.com and they were an amazing tour service. They took all six of us in a van around all of like the historical spots of Rome giving us a tour included a really good lunch it was like $15 lunch for really good food and it was 360 euros for all six of us and it was just like amazing and I would really recommend them if you're trying to see Rome on a budget because there's obviously like so much to see there so if you want to see Rome in a day use limoandrome.com because they were so nice and just best tour ever and I'm so sad I don't have footage of it because we saw like so much in one day all right get ready for the literal story of a lifetime okay so this night in Rome we're leaving dinner and Leslie leaves the restaurant first and she starts talking to these two guys that were sitting outside you know as she does and so then people on the streets start coming up to one of the men and start taking photos with him like he was a hot commodity everyone was asking him for photos so then leslie's like wait are you a superstar and his friend's like no he's a professional paddlewall player and so by this time the rest of us come out of the restaurant we're like who is 
this? And she's like, he's a famous paddleball player. And there's like three guys with him. So you know us, we're like, let's all go out together. So anyways, they say yes. And we embark on the streets of Rome. As we're walking to the streets to the first bar, people are still stopping him. So at this point, we're like, wait, we need a photo with him. We ask him what his name is. His name is Paquito. You cannot make this up. We're kind of texting on the side, debating if he really is a famous paddleball player. And that's when we realize that he is. He is not lying. He is number two in the world. Crazy. So we go out with them, have the most fun night of our entire life. Think movie party scene, just electric, good vibes. Like we're partying with a paddleball player in Rome. And then later that night, as we're walking from one bar to another, people start recognizing Paquito and they start hopping onto our group and they all join and come with us. There was a pull-up competition at one point and we say, Paquito, you gotta go do pull-ups. And he goes, okay, but you gotta chant my song. And we're like, what's your song? And he goes, <laughs> Paquito's on fire! And his manager that was with him was like, yeah, that's what his fans sing for him. And we're like, uh, okay. We check Instagram later that night and it turns out his fans actually sing. Literally every part about the story. It's a movie. It's not real. I don't know how this is my life. Anyways, we stay out till 4 a.m. I'm not even kidding. That is probably the latest I've ever stayed out. We come back to the Airbnb and we wake up the next morning at 11 a.m. to the cleaners of the Airbnb banging on the door. And they're like, you need to leave. It was safe to say the group was unwell. I start gathering everyone, rushing people out the door. No one's feeling great. We all get in the taxi and then we realize we have nowhere to go. We don't have a hotel. Up until this point, the trip was planned, but now we had nowhere to go. So anyways, we end up finding another hotel anyways we spend one more night in rome until we find out what we're doing we fly to the south of france south of france beautiful we stayed in Cannes. i loved it however i did run into a pole and i think actually i know i was slightly concussed and i was just a little unwell i just had a rough time but you guys can absolute movie it was perfect i'm so in love with it and i wish i could go back there but anyways now we're gonna cut to paris because that is the next clips that i have all right love y'all we're going to paris leaving the which I didn't yeah. vlog. Fun, yeah, we didn't vlog fun. At all. Yeah, sorry. Um, I went... was the best ever. So Can. Was... We're going to Paris now yes. from Nice. It's been an ordeal. We'll get into that later. <laughs> Landed in Paris. Here we are. Crazy. We're being patient, people, and letting everyone get off the plate first because, yeah. We made it to the Airbnb that we found quite literally last night. No, yeah, here. That's what I'm wearing. Yeah. Oh god, to bring suitcases up this. Okay, we're checking out the rooms. They're looking pretty good. I will say the entrance was in an alleyway. One bathroom. <laughs> Uh, we'll vlog where you can actually hear us, but Leslie's navigating us already. We're going to lunch. We just landed. I've been here before. Yeah, Leslie's been here before. That's why she's navigating us. Okay, y'all. We are officially in Paris. It has been quite... Like, I, every location, I feel like it's been quite the journey getting here. But basically, we were in Nice before this. Nice, France. All the trains were booked to get here. Flights were really expensive. We ended up staying next extra night. Getting a cheap flight. We made it. Long story short, we're here! But I'm wearing this super cute Zara dress. Leslie curled my hair super cute in the front to like match my natural hair in the back. We're all going to lunch. I'm so excited to be here. The last time I was here, I was like literally 11 wearing Justice. So I'm feeling a bit like, you know, awakened right now. Um, Guys, can everyone give me one word to describe our journey here? Just one. Chaotic. Damn. Chaotic. Expensive. I was talking about expensive. Uh, I got one. Rough. Rough. Yeah, we had a... Mizzy. 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 Mizzy is our word for miserable, but we're actually not Mizzy. No, life now, is good. Now we're good. Life is good. Okay, we're doing a quick fit check to show you guys how good these go together. Here it is. Fit Zara. Check. Zara. Neo Marcus. Love check fancy Hill house. It's all good together. Okay, our table's ready.
Having a little picnic. We'll take 2008. Okay, 2008, they're all taking guesses on how oh, many okay. sta uh, stairs. Like, how many stairs? Yeah. 3,004. I was thinking 3,000. I'm going to go with 1,700. 1,500? I don't know, everyone's going high. 2,025. It's in between Annalise and Leslie. Ooh. 1,600. I said 1,500. Wow, she said 1,700. Yeah. Oh, damn. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> Okay. So currently we are drinking wine with some treats in front of the Eiffel Tower and life couldn't get better. Life can get better. It really like, couldn't. these trees too. Like, the, like okay. look at all these trees. Oh! You guys are killing it. So we didn't have a blanket to sit on so we're, we tore up the paper bags from the grocery store and we were sitting Leslie did make a good deal, but on these. We're still here at the Eiffel Tower and there's a performer and Leslie cheered him on and he said the vibes were bad so we're trying to get the vibes up so that he'll sing. It's like Elf trying to get Santa Claus to come, you know? They're in love. It's so let's me. Y'all, this performer that we were like literally hyping up, he ended up yelling at us because we went up and talked to him and we we're like, hey, we're your biggest fans. We're like hyping him up. And he was like, yeah, I appreciate you guys. And then the conversation ended and these other guys came up. So we kind of like turned around and started talking to them. And then he yelled at us and he was like, you girls are disrespectful. Like you do not leave a conversation halfway through. And we we're like, hey, the conversation was over. And like, we didn't leave him. Like we literally just kind of turned around because like the conversation was over and he turned to his friend. That street performer literally yelled at us and was so condescending. So uh, anything I said in this vlog about being his number one fan, revoked, taken back, back to the vlog. Okay, the Eiffel Tower lights up on the hour every hour and we have seven more minutes we're waiting it's gonna like sparkle all lit up wait wait for it Sophomore year is definitely we're like waiting for it to sparkle okay new day this is today's activity <laughs> We're taking a boat along the sea. Sign? Send. Send. Thanks to her parents. If you guys are watching this, thank you guys. This is. Ah! We're also in corporate Paris. It's like all the commercial, like corporate buildings over here. Really cute. I would be honest, we did not have the most pleasant night in our Airbnb. I don't know if I showed you guys the entrance. It's like an alleyway, and we came home last night after seeing the Eiffel Tower at night. And there were like four men outside our door. Very sketchy. We were hearing things all night, so we gotta like figure out a better arrangement. But like we booked it to save money, and now we're like, we want to be safe. So did not have the most pleasant night of sleep. But now here we are, new day. We're we're here. We made it. Hello. I'm Macy. Oh. <laughs> We got grapes. We stopped and got these at this these little are place. Really good. Yeah, she says it's the best one yet. It's at this. What's it called? It's right by this little store called Gucci. None of us bought anything, but I'm getting a cookie butter crepe, and we're deciding where to stay tonight.
Good morning, y'all. The last time you saw us, I think we were in Paris. Yes, at a very sketchy Airbnb. We booked that Airbnb the day before. It was like, just not good. We ended up moving to a hotel. We had like two more days in Paris. I didn't vlog it, but now we're in Barcelona and it's just Annalise and I, everyone else left. We were kind of just like soaking up the last days all being together, but, but yeah, we had a great time in Paris. We had like a full week there and I think I only filmed two days. We're in Barcelona now and this hotel, y'all, we've been staying at Airbnbs and like, but this hotel just like literally popped off. Our stuff is everywhere, but let me show you. It's the Renaissance Barcelona Fira Hotel. Also, if I sound a little bit congested, I am a little sick, so. Okay, it's really messy right now because our stuff is all along that bench. We haven't really had a chance to unpack anywhere else, so we are here. But we have the bathroom when you walk in, my hanging toiletry bag, and Elise getting ready right hey. there. And then you keep walking, as I said, our stuff is everywhere. But this is my favorite part. This is the bed. Are you kidding? It's like surrounded by these white curtains. It's literally an oasis. I slept so good and I did not want to wake up like surrounded by white sheets. I want to like model that. Again, I'm going to link like everywhere where we're staying down below. We also switched to a really cute hotel in Paris that I'll link. Didn't vlog there, but really affordable. This one was the hotel where we kind of, you know, popped off, but here's the view. But we're gonna head and get food right now. We got here last night and we had this really good Mexican food place and we're gonna go back today. We're gonna go, energy's gonna get up. I'm wearing this black dress. It's kind of like cutting my sleeves, so we'll see. Cute little H&M necklace. Okay, you walk out the door and like, look at this. It's all- It's like outside. Yeah, that's all open air right here. There's plants all along the staircases. Like you can take the stairs down. It's so cool. See, that's- open like how but we're on our way to rosa negra our friend told us to go here and we went last night shout we were like Taylor. yeah shout out brie we were <laughs> shook it was like good Guys, rice and beans it was mexican like really delicious like so, really really good i'm we're a doing that now. and then we're gonna look at the sagrada familia la sagrada familia look around do some shopping our other pie pie friends are in town oh yeah i told you guys that so we're gonna get dinner tonight We got here 30 minutes too early. Okay, we're in. It was really easy to buy tickets. You just like scanned a QR code and there's no line. Nope. So let's see if it's worth 26 euros. There's no oh. Cool. Oh my god. I think I'm gonna get married in here. I'm gonna, ask, I'm gonna arrange something and ask if they can do that for me. <laughs> This is nice. I think they keep this table open so that you can take photos. <laughs> Literally. Um, also, this is not the Sagrada Familia. It's it's it's, li it's it's little. Hey. It's her little sister. This is like really vibey right now. Um, if you guys are wondering, these are fellow Pi Beta Phi's from my Texas Delta sorority. <laughs> And what, is, what actually goes <laughs> in the cup? And we will actually we all across the world together yeah. to celebrate five five. Such a strong pun. <laughs> Guys, we're actually sarcastic, we do. <laughs> Can fish. <laughs> Uh, 